It's a Monday morning, the second week of Azimio La Umoja protest across the country. Most businesses' premises remain closed within Nairobi, CBD, and Kisumu, following the fear of destruction and loss of properties. The few traders who turned up to their businesses had this to say. Hey, kwa majina naitwa Johnston, uh, mwana biashara Nairobi. Uh, biashara ya, ya siku ya leo imesambaratika kabisa kwa sababu ya ma, maandamano. Tunafanya biashara na matatu. Na ningesitaka kusema kuwa maandamano ya leo imetuadhiri pakubwa sana. E, kazi hakuna, hakuna watu wamekataa kutokea, wamekataa kwenda kazini, hakuna watu. So leo ni kwenda kulala nja. Aya, kwa, ma, kwa majina mina itua David Msau na mini mfuasi wa Zimio Sugu. Leo tumona mambo vile imekua mambo ijakua poa itao. Watu, watu enye wa mogopa. Kama sisi wana biashara tunazorota kwa sababu biashara yetu inasambaratika kabisa. Demonstrators in Kibra burn tires while exchanging stones and tear gas with the police. In as much as businesses were deteriorating, some Kenyans felt that it was a necessary evil for the greater good of the nation. I support the Mandamano thing. If this is what as Kenyans will bring our president down to listen to common Mwanainji, let it go. If it is what will help us, come to, uh, people come down to, from the ivory towers and for the good of the country, so be it. Because for every good thing there has to be a sacrifice. It is better we do demonstration not two times but three times a, three times a week if that is what will bring him down to, to to hear us now see today or tomorrow we shall be paying 100 shillings will be giving us two units of electricity during the time of uru and raila the had shake we 100 shillings and six units ruto e mwenyewe alisema kika bible chini life ita change lakini unaona sasa hivi le hali iko what one has struggled, what one umia. When I heard the president speaking about the privatization of universities and the all other, and another public public universities and other institutions, this was very bad for me. Because you can imagine all the people who are employed by the universities. Take Nairobi University, take Kato University, take Moranga University, take all other universities, including Kenyatta University here. Uh, the private owner shall come and say, I want 50 workers. All other 2,000 workers, they go home. Elsewhere, in Busia, the demonstration was peaceful, despite the police stopping the demonstrators from accessing the town. Tumekuwa na maandamano ya amani na mimi nashukuru sana polisi kwa sababu kama sio polisi pia wametuambia hawataki vitu ziharibike town na sisi tumesema tutarusha mawe town Kwa hivyo askari nasema ni asante, tena Thursday tutakuwa na mandamano ya ama, ya amani. Kwa hivyo, vijana, mimi nita kuambia, tuache tufanya mandamano ya amani, tusiaribu popote, masamu tunataka unga iende chini, na watu wetu wabusia, wapate haki yao. Tuambia ndugu zetu polisi, sisi watu kwa na shida hii, wajue kwamba, sisi hatusaili kwa naandika barua ya kuomba hao kwa nataka kuandamana, tunaandika barua ya kuwaonye, kwa notify kwamba, tunaenda kuandamana. So hatuitaji kuwa tunapewa ruhusa, we only notify them kwamba takuanda kufanya maandamano. Sisi hatuwa katika vita, 
sisi tuko nalilia mwananchi yule ambaye anapotoa nafasi ya kuongea kwa niaba yake na ni haki yetu kuongea kwa niaba ya wananchi ambao wamepewa nafasi ya kuwazunguzaji wao tuko katika maandamano yetu ya amani ya kuwa, ya kuhakikisha ya kwamba hatutaki bidhaa kupanda bei tunataka bei tunataka sava pia ifunguliwe na tunataka haki itendeke tunataka katiba ifuatwe sawa sawa ikawaje kwa sasa tumekaziwa ya kwamba tuwezi ingia town lakini tunasema siku ya Thursday tunaandika barua siku ya Thursday tutahakikisha tumeingia town tunaandamana kwa sababu unga imepanda bei juu stima iko bei juu tuwezi peleka watoto shule tuwezi kula na tumekuwa na maandamana mani na waachane na baba baba ni wetu baba ni serikali aheshimu mzee aheshimu mzee Kenyans urge both the government and opposition to embrace the dialogue and find a long lasting solution to the ongoing high cost of living so tunaomba serikali kaeni chini msikizane msifanye msijifanye wajeuri eh Uwezi jua uhuru alikaa chini akazungumza na wao mzee na mambo ikakuwa shwari kabisa. Unaona? So mimi ningeomba rigade ruto ka chini kama sisi wananchi tunaumia. Nyenye muumi nyenye mko kwa serikali. Sisi ndio tunaumia kama wananchi. Nayo serikali ipunguze unga. Tuunga ndio tunalilia. Hizo mambo za sava hatujui hizo ni nini. Apunguze unga peke yake. Alafu pia gavana yeye promise vitu zenye aweze afford. Isaidie vijana kulingana na vilile waidi. Ruto wewe mwenyewe alisema kika Bible chini life ita change lakini unaona sasa hivi le hali iko watu wana struggle watu wana I don't have a problem but the problem is for the leadership to come down and people have a middle ground the winner to carry, to rule but rule with together with the, those who lost Hapo yeah. akichukua serikali was talking about the boda boda man the boda boda za i have not seen them being helped he was talking about the mamamboga i have not seen in the cs any mamamboga there i have seen people like kidero who have lost the elections they are being rewarded what is that for more updates continue watching culture hub tv my name is asham patrick <laughs> Oh, my God.